everybody out there is doing good and great. I'm doing good myself, okay? So today, y'all, I was about to jump into a, a voiceover. So y'all know I didn't post anything for Saturday and Sunday. Saturday and Sundays... I try to just, yeah, chill off of YouTube because you can get really caught up into YouTube to why you find yourself like, okay, I done spent all day. I done been sitting in this chair from sun up to sundown. And so, no, I, I prefer that to just be Monday through Friday. If I put out more than five videos, okay, then, hey, it's a wrap. I cut off way before then. Y'all already know that by now. Um... So, yeah, with that being said, sometimes I don't even go and check my emails unless I'm bored and I ain't got nothing to do at the house. Yeah, in the house bored. So, I'll be on it. Or I just wait and come back Monday, okay? Um, and as of now, like I said, I was getting ready to get on here, y'all. And um, I was going to do a voiceover for y'all. Um, or behind the voiceover, okay? Um and so I was like, let me go in here and check my emails real quick because I have not checked them. So I went in here and I see a lot of people was telling me where to cruise, go get in the YouTube streets, what's going on, da 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 da, whoop de whoop de woo. Go over here and check out this channel. They, yeah, whoop de whoop de woo. What they saying? <laughs> so I was like, okay, you know. And then I had one that gave me a lot of screenshots from, from Facebook, okay? And it's still dealing with my jazz in life. We, I mean, my jazz in life just can't get a break, can she? Uh, <laughs> um, so anyway, I just want to say to everybody that reached out, everybody that was, yeah, pushing the emails to me and the info and, yeah, thank y'all. I appreciate it, y'all. As y'all can see, I already reached out and replied back to all y'all telling y'all thank you, okay? Everything that you do is I do appreciate. Um, So anyways, y'all, we just going to... I'm trying to see if I can put some of these clips in here. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to, yeah, give my thoughts and my opinion on what's going on. So this here and the clips come from here, they they actually not from um, YouTube. It's not from the YouTube streets and it's not from Instagram. This look like it is Facebook. Okay, so y'all also remember the last time... Was it the first time? I think it was the first time my Jazzy Life went live. I want to say it was the first time she went live. Not the first time, y'all, but recently. Um, she talked about a situation with something going on on Facebook or somebody she was into. So I'm wondering, is this um, uh, the same people? I don't know. But me reading a lot of this, well, I caught one comment of somebody was calling her a child abuser. Um, and a lot of this info is not going to be... If y'all actually seen it or y'all went over to, um, what's up, Blama? Somebody said Blama has it too. So if y'all went over there, she probably have hers in order. I ain't put nothing in order. I'm going by with the clips that I received. So, um, I'm just reading that, y'all. So, they may not be in order. So, if y'all actually went over there and, and mine's, it's just kind of, it's how I received it. Um, so I'm just gonna talk about it. Um, so my Jazzy life, y'all know how she be on the YouTube streets and she be saying like she be on her positive shit, right? Which means she don't respond to negativity. So I feel like if this is what you go off of, or if, if this is really you, you wouldn't be responding back to the foolishness if it's really foolishness, okay? And I say if it's really foolishness because at the end of the day, if you got somebody on here and somebody is telling telling you, okay, telling you about what you're supposed to be, babe, what your man said, okay, or what he is saying about you, evidently there's got to be some truth to this. Also, if you got somebody in here that's telling you about your bae or about your boo and what he is doing on the side, and evidently, I said evidently, y'all already know that, um, that for what we see, shit, they don't look like they have shit going on, okay? Um, I also seen a screenshot of them yesterday playing basketball or whatever that video was. And all I could say to that was, you know, I haven't even went over and watched, but shit, about damn time y'all doing something together besides picking up a liquor bottle or, yeah, drinking and, yeah, about time. Um, 
But anyways, I'm just saying there got to be some type of truth behind this. And also, it's got to be some type of truth behind this for her to actually jump on her. And you know what I'm saying? Giving laugh emojis and all this type of shit. Because if this shit wasn't true, you wouldn't even jump into the nonsense, y'all. I'm going to have to put on my broke glasses today because a lot of this shit I cannot see. And I'm trying and it's like, I can't. So I'm just going to read off a few of the comments. Okay. The first comment says, what does it say? See, I have to put my glasses on. Y'all. Dead way. <laughs> the first comment says, child abuse or child neglect. Um, so my Jazzy life actually came back and my Jazzy life respond. Okay, she was like, you funny, LOL, with the laughing emoji. So also, the lady came back to say, this was somebody else uh, to respond to say, <clears throat> um, we understand you're laughing at yourself to make yourself feel good, LOL. We get it. And that's another thing. At the end of the day, when you have somebody on here talking about how you neglect your kids and how you abuse your kids... I don't feel like it's funny. You could say that the people is funny, but if they sitting here talking about this shit up in your chat about you abusing them kids, and yeah, y'all know we get on here and we talk about it, right? But for somebody else to come in here and tell you about what you are doing to your kids off camera, also to tell you about... <clears throat> What's going on with you and Chris? Yeah, that's a whole that's a whole problem. I wouldn't be laughing at that shit. At the end of the day, if you if you know nothing about it or it's not true, I wouldn't even be laughing or even coming. I would be just zip quiet on this shit. Um somebody else said you're laughing to cover Chris beating and using you. Hmm. Beating and using you. Hmm. Beating and using you. For sure, we already know Chris is using the hell out of her. We know that. We know that. Um, and this is crazy to me, y'all, because this actually go beyond the YouTube streets, okay? With her coming over here, I'm going to have to keep adjusting them, y'all. But with her keep coming to the YouTube streets saying how people is bullying her and doing this and doing that, where well, it looked like it's not only... Hey, no, let me take that back. Y'all already know that that's not what's going on. People be actually trying to call out her shit, and that's, that's what's going on over here. But now we can see that this shit has actually moved on to Facebook, okay? So it's not just YouTube, but it's Facebook too, so shit. But Facebook giving a little bit more tea than what y'all told giving. Um... She also commented and said, you're laughing to hide your embarrassment of beating your kids and hating Amaya and Kaylin. Uh, we get it, Corky. Uh, somebody also said, girl, slowness at its finest. Something is seriously mentally wrong with her. Instead of defending herself, etc., she laughed and she is a mentally uh, delay, trifling, trifling. That's what I'm saying. I wouldn't be giving no feedback of laughing or even giving laughing emojis because shit, if, if, if this shit is not really what's going on, I'm finna clear my shit. If I can't clear my shit, then I'm gonna shut the hell up. Okay. Um, the next comment says, Jazz, I hope you know you're what, Jess? I hope you know your exact apartment number is public. So chill, dude. Please don't play bad with me. I'm in Austin. Uh, and so is Joanne. So whoever this is that's on some real shit, she's saying shit. Jazz, don't play that bad shit with me because, hell, I'm in Austin too. I'll come get on your ass. And and that's another thing, y'all. Um, I do want to say about that. When you coming out here and it's it's okay to talk, but but to really feel like you know you gotta take it, you gotta take it that far because of what she's saying or what's going on. Yeah, it ain't that serious shit. If she gonna be slow, let her be slow. You know, let her do what she do. Um. <clears throat> so one person was saying 
uh, that they was unsubscribing. She said, oh, wow, unsubscribing from her YouTube. Haven't been on in a while. She's sad. And Jasmine actually responded. She, she, oh, oh, she must be on her strong juice today, y'all, because she responded and said, LOL, bye. Girl, with a laughing emoji. Girl, no, we're not going to do that because you know you need your subscribers. Your subscribers is what pays you. You get what I'm saying? And at the end of the day, while you over here on Facebook talking mad, mm -hmm, yeah. <laughs> don't don't talk that shit, okay? Now I see why they want to pull up on you. Like, girl, I know you. I know your address. <laughs> um. All right, next comment, y'all. What said? She, you never wash your hands. You never take baths. Only when he makes you. Hold up. Wait. What? Damn. Okay, so my thing on that, how would somebody actually know that? You get what I'm saying? I know we'd seen that clip before. Y'all remember when she was in a uh she was in a restroom. She was in a bathroom, I mean. She was in a bathroom and she was on um she was on live, okay? And when she got up, she washed her hands for not even a good two seconds and then start trying to wash her face. I don't know what the hell she was doing. But it's crazy for somebody saying she don't wash her hands. Well, we know that shit, how she be in the kitchen rubbing her nose and doing all that type of shit and still fixing them kids' food. But to say, like, shit, she never take a bath only when he make her shit. That, that there is not a good look. Like, who needs they bae or they boo to tell you to take a bath? Ooh, I know I always worried about your hygiene and I always knew like, girl, you weren't so clean, but damn, to have this out here, right here, on here, <laughs> for everybody to see, shit, that ain't no good look. Um, You won't clean up that roach infested apartment. You beat the hell out of Amaya. You favor that, you favor that over over Ava, okay. Um, also somebody commented and said, Wow, that's sad and embarrassing. Dang, she's like that. Girl, yeah, it's very embarrassing if somebody know that you don't wash your hands and, and Chris over there gotta make you bathe and, and clean yourself up as being a grown ass female. You are not a kid. You are and see that was the uh voiceover that I wanted to do, y'all, because I went over to what is it? The title of the channel is Pull Up a Seat, I believe. And I listened to how Philip talks to Jazz. And it reminds you to today of the same shit that we tell her. Like, girl, stop your excuses. Just stop being lazy and get up off your ass and do what you need to do. Um. Anyways, y'all. So the next comment was like, sound like Jasmine is a nasty trick. Jazz is nasty, y'all. Y'all can see it by her appearance, by what we see. We already know what she is, okay? She she come on here, just yeah, we already know what she is. Um. Somebody also said, very sad. Very sad. Us. What they say? Very sad as a woman. Okay. These women gonna beat her ass. She better be careful in Austin. Yeah, y'all. People crazy. Okay. And if they bold enough to try to tell you, like, talk your shit. <laughs> talk your shit. We know your door number. We know your house. Yeah, we'll pull up on you. Yeah, you better watch this shit. And I've been told y'all, I said shit, everybody ain't gonna take your mouth, Jazz, about you talking all that shit, because the, you don't know who is right around you, okay? That's 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 the funny part. And all of them talk major shit. That was just like my little like she talked major, major shit. But you don't know who is right around you, okay? And like I said, like, girl... And if somebody ever pull up or run up or however, you ain't gonna be on that same energy that you giving on the on on social media. You're not gonna give that same energy, but but for entertainment, okay, and for your your subscribers and your little fans or whatever the hell you wanna call these people that's all on your ass on her, they not gonna be there to save you when yeah you come face to face with what you asking for. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that way. <laughs> um, 
Also, somebody said, Chris says she doesn't bathe only maybe once a week. So, fuck. So, who is Chris telling this shit to? If this shit is so true, who is he talking to about this? Mm. So, is this the same one that was saying about him having different females? So, evidently, he is telling what's going on over there to somebody else. But that goes back to Dirty Builds a Boy, his damn self. Shit, you can't be too clean yourself. You can't be about your shit, your damn self, if that's what you settle for, okay? She's settling for you, and I guess you are doing the same, because shit, yeah, y'all both ain't about shit. Um... Uh, let's see. Somebody said whack comment boo. I don't know what they say, y'all. I'm trying to read these comments out to you and react on them at the same damn time. Okay, somebody said, man, who the fuck is these bitches fucking with? Goofy as hell, for real. Um... Jazz come back. She said, bro, sick ass people. But I want to know why is you entertaining this, okay? At the end of the day, you have a whole platform. You have numbers. Why would you be entertaining this shit? That is what I'm saying. If if what they saying is lies and, and it's not true, okay, and you don't do none of this and Chris ain't said none of this, why is you engaging in this shit? And that's what I said before, just jumping back over to the YouTube streets. Like, She'll say, like, she don't watch reactors, y'all, right? But she'll be worried about what the hell we we saying. But she'll come back to say, like, I don't watch them. But then she'll come over to our comments and do this same shit right here. Comment, okay? She'll comment, but she'll have it to why you can't comment back to her. You know what I'm saying? But then she try to, that's like, she out here shit. She doing shit, but she hiding her hand about it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm on positive shit. I'm, this ain't positive shit right here because you giving them exactly what they want. You giving them the feedback. But if these chicks right here pull up on your ass, can't nobody on this social media, on this internet, on this Facebook, on these YouTube streets save you, okay? And it look like Chris will be right along with them because at the end of the day, he is putting your shit out here for everybody, okay? Yeah, exposing that ass. Um, somebody said people who care more about her children than she does yep and that's why a lot of people is doing what they are doing now is because they care about the kids. Not, th not that they give a fuck about jazz, but you're grown, okay? You're real grown. So you have to, you have to take responsibilities for your actions, okay? Yeah, that has nothing to do with the kids. And like the shit that you're doing right here, right now, don't bring that shit over here to the YouTube streets and say, hey, they over there bullying and people just this and that. No, you engaging in that shit. So that, that, you add fuel to the fire, that shit gonna get bigger, right? So, shit, it is what it is. I'm just saying. Um, somebody also says, says, this MF with absolutely nothing on the page, a weirdo ass MF, Jasmine Dukes, keep keep doing what you need to, to buy them kids. MFs don't know, ish, what does that say? MFs don't know ish about what kind of people we is okay and see it's the people like that 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 tries to yeah y'all don't see the shit that she do and y'all see her and just flow with it like it's absolutely nothing wrong so jazz come back y'all she sh she is engaging in this shit okay she got time she has nothing but time on her hands okay she said y'all y'all are all sick and obsessed at this point I'll keep praying for y'all. Girl, nobody's obsessed with you, okay? And and what I want you to understand, you need to go back and look at your videos and your pictures and Chrissy pictures and Chrissy videos. And, and it'll show you what obsessed is because obsessed is you, okay? You are the perfect picture and perfect of of perfect example of being obsessed so how the hell can you call somebody being obsessed with you nobody is obsessed with you somebody's on her talking they shit and they not gonna go for you talking your shit they just not gonna go for it they tired of your shit they tired of yeah but i'm not saying and i'm not saying 
that it's okay and it's a cool way for you to, hey, no, because at the end of the day, if you really look at all of this shit here, it's childish, okay? I'm not going to pull up at nobody else. I'm not going to do none of that shit. You you do what you do. You're going to get back what comes to you, but shit, you have some of those people, shit, they got time, okay? Just like she got time to sit here and respond to this shit, they got time to pull up at her crib, okay? Um... No, I think it's you who's sick and sad with proof to show it. Prayers for prayers for you, not them, LOL. Um, Jasmine the Priest Dukes, girl, pray for yourself and change your life. Get the children some help, especially those twins. You look bad out here in these streets. Um no respect for yourself. Or your children, damn, near near 30 with a mindset of a child. Ooh. She do look bad in these streets, y'all. Shit. Some days I be I be feeling like shit. Okay, I'ma let her. I'm going to let her breathe the day. You know what I'm saying? But it's like there's always some type of nonsense. There's always something to talk about. At the end of the day, if I was her, I would just lay low and take a fucking break for real. Okay? Do some shit to try to revamp your shit. Okay? And with revamping your channel, you have to take some of the advice that it's giving. You have to do better for as your kids. And not saying or trying to clean up and decorate is showing it doing better, but no, actually do better and not do better with this fake ass shit, okay? Because sometimes you could tell when the shit is fake and when the shit is real. So yeah, she ain't looking good in no in no streets. She ain't looking good over her when you make that go down that street, make that make that left turn. You know what I'm saying? Go down a little bit, make a right. When <laughs> when you get on the YouTube street, she ain't looking good over there. When you take the next street over, you know what I'm saying? Take that left, cut that corner. Yeah, she ain't looking good in the Facebook streets. Neither shit. She over her beefing hard, really hard. And I think at the end of the day, like I said before in my other video, your reactors is not your real problem. Your re These reactors is not your real issue, okay? It's it's greater than that. It's it's beyond us, okay? This situation right here is greater than that, and it has nothing to do with, guess what, a fucking reactor, okay? Um, somebody said you deserved all of this. She do. Shit, payback is a bitch, okay? We, I'm, everybody been on Jazz ass for a long time. Everybody been on Jazz ass before Chris, been on Jazz ass after Chris, okay? Now all this shit is popping up. They on her ass now, but the shit is really hot. Girl, I'll just take a break yeah just just chillax okay get the get the hell off of social media for a little bit okay and i ain't talking about a couple days or a week and you think this fire gonna no i'm talking about maybe like a month or so okay just let it just yeah for you actually get your ass snatched up out here fucking with chris <laughs> um somebody also said because like everything else, she wants people to do it for her instead of doing herself it herself. Yes, yeah, she always looking for that handout. She can't go through nothing in her house and say, hey, y'all, I bought this myself or this and that. She can't do that shit because everything that she got, somebody have gave it to her, okay? She ain't working for shit at all. Um, Somebody said, you never, oh, that was the same comment. Hold on, y'all. Sorry, y'all. This chair is squeaking some damn terrible. Uh, let's see. Did she send me doubles? Oh, Lord. I really can't see this. Hold on, y'all. Okay, she said... Ooh. Yeah, I can't see these comments. Okay. She said, he definitely sees my words and I tried to hold them, but I asked him for forgiveness because you needed to hear this. Um, stop putting them kids last and only talking to them. Con I want to say talking to, to them on, oh, okay. It meant to be on camera yet. You beat them off camera. 
So who is putting out there that she beats them, okay? I mean, I know what we saw, but to actually know. And this chick here, what is her name? Jo Joanne. Um, girl, who are you? Because she said he definitely sees my words and I tried to hold them, but I asked him for forgiveness because you needed to hear this. So I wonder who is she? She got to be somebody that Chris know because she said that, that he definitely see her words and he she asked him for forgiveness for what she is saying. Okay. Um, you put in Chris first as if he wants you. That man can, can't stand you and... And you and you that gullible. I know exactly who he chills with, but that's neither here or there. Grow up and get your life together and stop trying to be like Chrissy and live. You making yourself look played all around. So this girl here, I don't want to call her chick. This girl here, she knows Chris. She knows who he chills around. And she also know uh Chrissy and Liv basically watching. So is this? Oh, mm, trying to read this, y'all. Hmm. So there's got to be somebody that knows him. That's real close to him. That know a lot of shit. Twins, mom, baby mama, ex girlfriend, somebody he chilling with now. Mm -hmm. Um, you think it's a game to beat those kids and laugh about it and starve them and keep keep them locked in a room while you give head, girl. Oh, that's why you put that that safety lock on the outside of that door. You don't want no interruptions of when you in that room doing whatever you do. But at the end of the day, I wouldn't be doing shit for Chris. Chris, Chris ain't doing shit for you, okay? Whatever. What we do know is that he is putting y'all business, y'all personal so-called business out here in these streets, okay? So he's filling it with somebody. And if she know all this, the question goes, who are you? Okay. Are you a baby mama friend? Okay. Are you somebody that he actually chills with? Um, yeah. Joanne, yeah. You better think smart. She ain't on her just telling you this shit. She know what it is. Um, nah, that ain't cool. You trifling as hell. You do not need kids. You always funky, always lying with the worst YouTube channel ever, fake ass tears. Make a video about it so I can know I shook you. Hmm. Oh. You never wash your hands, you never take baths. Okay, so that. So y'all, the question is, who y'all think this girl is? That gets me to thinking, too, when I be saying, who is my shabby life? Who is, yeah, who is young and the desperate? Now I'm over here on Facebook trying to wonder who is Joanne. Is it Joanne Kiki Richards? She know a lot about Chris and a lot about Jazz. So she is somebody that's in close, okay? I just want to say this is sad because, you know, at the end of the day, we talk about this shit all day, every day over here on the YouTube streets. But now it's actually it's actually over here on Facebook. It has moved to Facebook. OK, yeah. And you got your family over there and everything. So hmm. I wonder what's good. Telling Jazz, go make a video about it. I don't know what to say, y'all. I shit. <laughs> Who pulling up, though? <laughs> um, yeah, whoever that is, I wish they'll come out so we all know who she is. And at the end of the day, I've been told y'all, Chris ain't for her. He out there doing his own thing. That's why he can't give her shit for Valentine's Day. He can't give her nothing for her birthday. He can't give her nothing for Christmas. He can't give her shit at all, okay? The only thing that he is giving her is a is a, 
is a glass of wine or a glass of liquor, okay? He ain't giving her shit. He ain't giving her nothing extra. And then for her to open her house up to him, and you open your house up to all this drama, okay? Not just drama, just about your kids, but the drama is about to start with Chris too, okay? Man. Woo! -woo. Anyways, y'all, that's it for this video. I just want to touch these screenshots, okay, to let you know, yes, girl, I got it. Let me talk about it. And yeah, we'll keep sitting back in the cut, throwing that popcorn up, you know what I'm saying, catching it and see what comes next. But girl, Jazz, what you don't do, don't go back and forth and try to talk your hot shit and then you gonna run, go run or go play hide and seek. No, come out. You gotta stand behind what you saying. If you that bad bitch on social media, you need to be that same way when they come out to play. You understand? Anyways, y'all, that's it for this video. If y'all like this video let's throw those thumbs up and if y'all have not i do a job